how does a person looking to buy their first tactical light figure out what all the lumens issue means? Well, you're right, Lum, it, and it does get pretty tricky. Um, a f few years ago, we formed an NC standard in the industry, which um, tells pretty much apples to apples. So if you're looking at packaging of different manufacturers, you can compare right on the um, package what lumens is. Now, lumens can be a misconception, though, because just because a light has a lot of lumens doesn't necessarily mean it has a lot of distance. So through different technologies like the SuperTAC X that you carry, you, it has a much bigger reflector. Um, that light, this is the exact same light in the TL2 as a SuperTAC with a smaller head. Now the lumens are similar, but this light has four times the distance if you're shooting long ranges. Now lumens is important because it does tell you how bright the light is at the at head of the light. So when I call a light on that's 200 lumens, it is much, much brighter than a 130 lumen light. Um, but once again, it really comes into the design and the engineering that goes into the uh, lens and the bezel of the light to give you the distance. Um, if you're doing a lot of in-house stuff, you may want a very high lumen light that gives you a flood pattern, so you light up a lot of your room. Where if you're shooting outdoors, you may want a high lumen light that also has a lot of candela distance. for distance. So in candela, that's what you're talking about is, is how far you're going out there with the light. That how is correct. How far you can see. 